，我刚才 end 在哪里？在 unit， 小雨，就是我。Oh no！ 哦。So home journey is at District 19 again, and today we are at the terrace in Pongo. Today's unit is a four bedder, one three one three square feet. Comes with a functional layout and renovated to a timeless and modern design. And this unit is sitting on a high floor, having a very quiet facing. Located along Pongo Drive and Ashfield Plains, the terrace is actually the largest EC along the Pongo Waterway with seven hundred forty-seven units, ranging from three to five bedrooms. There will only be three condos with a waterfront facing, and one of it is the terrace. Water Town and Pyrmont Grand, which is yet to TOP. So the terrace MOP in May 2022 and it will be opened up to Singaporean and SPR. So in another five more years in 2027, it will open up to foreigners as well. So the terrace is actually the youngest condo and the latest addition to the resale market because the next one will be only available in 2028, that is Pyrmont Grand EC. The terrace is sitting on a big land of 259,034 square feet. And this is actually one of the most attractive selling points of the development. Because of the big land size, the developer can cater more space for facilities. There are bar lounges, KTV and even a dance studio. So we trust that all your needs will be met. And you get a wide range of facilities at a low maintenance of $350 per month. Eateries and malls are within minutes away with schools and transportations readily available for everyone. So let's check out the unit now. Entering the house, the first impression of this area here is really very wide and open. So together with the living hall in front and the dining area at the back, it forms a very broad frontage. And this kind of layout is actually my personal favourite because it allows maximum sunlight and breeze coming into the house. So the owner has actually used early tone for the theme of the renovation and it gives a very clean and warm look. With the cove lighting and recessed light, it actually enhances the vibe, making the house even more welcoming. So let's officially start the home tour right from the entrance. So here, on my left, we have this row of three tall cabinets for storage. It has actually a DB box well hidden inside, but the developer has actually made use of this area for storage purpose. So on my right, there's this cabinetry here next to the entrance will be of course our shoe cabinet. So owner has done out this four door cabinet here to actually keep our shoes away. And in the middle, we have this open section. You can place your family photo or any other decorative items that you have, or more commonly nowadays, you can put your hands sanitizer or mask or anything that you need to grab before you head out and this shoe cabinet is actually very cleverly thought out because owner has done this let me show you so owner has actually cut out this section right here that serves as a discrete air ventilator to eliminate odor from the shoe cabinet so it does not actually affect the exterior design so moving along, we have this feature wall right here that is made up of white bricks. It adds contrast and rustic feel to the house. So this brick here are all real bricks, which owner has actually sliced it thinly and stacked it up one by one that fit up onto the wall. So this wall serves as a TV feature wall. Bracket has been added to whole heavy load like this big TV right here. So the owner has done up this wall hung cabinet to hide your console and wires and you can see there's this big sofa that has placed here we still have a very good viewing distance from the tv so behind this living area will be our dining space which currently serves six to eight packs and owner has done this row bench here which doubles up as a storage bench so look at the bottom here we have this angled in which gives you more leg space so at the side of the bench there is actually power socket so you can have steamboat dinner with your friends too so the owner has actually integrated surround sound system for the whole house. Look up here. Fun fact 1. Benefit of using bench. Firstly, more people can accommodate on a bench than individual chairs. Secondly, benches do not consume space the way chairs do. So moving out to the balcony, owner has actually installed zip track to block heat and rain and usually the balcony comes with a single lighting point where currently the fan is and owner is really very thoughtful because he has extended out the four ceiling to install more lights to brighten the balcony. And this balcony serves multiple usage because you can actually bring out your dining table and also set up a children's play area or even cover up a space 
for your swing chair. The development is situated on a gradual slope with a spread up three-tiered terrace design, namely the exciting waterfront terrace, where you can find a beautiful 50 meter beach pool with pavilions at the side for you to enjoy the waterway view. The architectural Broadway terrace, characterized by the timber origami deck and a unique origami shaped pool, and also the peaceful mediation terrace with the yoga decks, hammocks and water streams. Aside from the bar lounge, KTV and dance studio mentioned earlier, there are also kids' playroom, reading lounges, a large waterfront gym, aqua gym, and a stylish design sports bar and games room. There are also several function rooms, barbecue pits, kids' pool, and many pavilions for your gatherings. A special highlight is the urban farming area, which I think is very well maintained by the residents here. So this development has a wide variety of facilities, ensuring something for everyone to enjoy. All common walkways of the development uses wooden deck instead of typical cement walkways, which give off a quality of life feel. Consistent warm color palette and theme used throughout the development adds to the warm and serene atmosphere. The terrace is also bounded by glass panels so that the residents here can enjoy the view around them. So let's head back to the unit for the kitchen. Over to Celine. So this area here is your dry kitchen area. It comes with an island top. In front here, you can put some high chairs, so this can act as your breakfast counter. So behind here, there is some deep drawers and cabinet space that you can put big items like your big pots and bulky electrical appliances that you seldom use. The countertop is also overlaid with a glass top, so this is for easy maintenance as well as adding classiness to the whole house. So at the back here, there's a big space for your fridge and I think it's big enough for fitting a two-door fridge. There are also additional six-panel cabinets for your storage. So there's a sliding door over here that separates the dry and wet kitchen area. It prevents fumes and grease from going to the rest of the house. There's also a glass panel over here that allows natural light to come in from the living room. Top and bottom cabinet has already been done and this two door over here is added by the owner. Originally, it's an open shelving. So with the two door, it protects the item inside from dust and grease from cooking. So the owner has also found the original contractor that has done cabinetries for the whole development to customize these two door panels. Built-in oven is over here and you can see that the owner has taken care of the kitchen in a very good condition. So if you are here for viewing, you can come and check this out. Spotless. There's a space here for your washer and a window over here for better ventilation if you are closing your door when you're cooking. So if the countertop space is not enough, you can do additional table over here with storage at the bottom. So behind here, this is the yard area. The Steigen clothes rack has already been installed and this is the WC area. It comes with a window and they have converted this area to a big sink area for easy washing of laundry. And opposite here, this is the bomb shelter. Currently, it's used as a storage room for the owners. So let's talk about the amenities here. Right opposite the terrace at block 639, you will find a supermarket for your grocery. There are also 7-Eleven, Kopitiam, Bakery, Clinics, Hair Salons and ATM machines as well. On the connectivity, we are also well served by TPE, Valdi Pongo Central and Pongo Road. From the side gate, we are connected to Kadalor LRT station. One stop down or within 5 minutes walk, you will find Oasis Terrace where there is NTUC, Anytime Fitness and also lots of eateries. Three stops down, you also find Waterway Point where you have more food choices and even a cinema for you to catch a movie with your family. That's where you will find Pongo MRT and Bus Interchange which can bring you to the rest of the Singapore. One Pongo, the new Pongo Town Hub which is expected to open in mid-2022 will add wide range of facilities and amenities including a hawker centre, rooftop BBQ pits, five-storey library and a childcare centre. There will also be community club, HDB branch, futsal, basketball and badminton courts. More future developments such as the Pongo Digital District which is ready in 2023 will also bring work closer to you. Spread across 50 hectares, the district is integrated with the new SIT campus and JTC Business Park and connected to Pongo via the Northeast Line at Pongo Coast MRT Station. It will be a vibrant smart space to live, work and play. For nature lovers, the park connector is just right outside the development. The path will lead you all the way to Waterway Park and Pongo Safra where you can find lots of activities to enjoy with your family. Coney Island is also minutes drive away. This is definitely one of the favourite cycling and picnic spots for families. 
the new Pongo Regional Sports Centre, which is expected to complete in 2023, will bring new sports facilities to the estate. As for schools, for families with young kids, there are lots of primary schools within 1km radius. For younger kids, there are also a number of childcare and preschools nearby. Moving on to the rooms. The first common room on my left is having the same facing as the living room with a full height window. Come check it out. This room is pretty spacious and the original wardrobe is still here. Currently, it has a baby cot inside here, but I think you can fit a queen size comfortably. The ceiling fan and light has also been installed. So right across, this is the common bathroom. Upon entering, you will notice the cabinet, vanity and contrasting textured tiles used, making the bathroom looks clean and stylish. Right next to it is the second common bedroom. So looking at the size, you can fit a queen size bed as well. The original wardrobe has already been removed, so you have the flexibility to arrange the furniture to suit your needs. This room used to be a media room, so you can see a very nice deco textured wall over here. It can be a TV feature wall, and it adds dimension and contrast to the whole room, but yet not compromising the space. The recessed light has already been done, so this adds ambience to the whole room. Fun fact 2. Stacco is energy efficient, fire resistant, low maintenance, road resistant, sound deepening and add great appeal to your home. Currently, the master room has been combined with the common room to form a bed plus study layout, creating a space that's perfect for working from home. So currently, we are in the bedroom area. The original wardrobe has already been removed to create more space for the whole room. Currently, it fits a king-size bed with two bedside tables. And you can see the same stacco textured wall over here. It creates a very nice backdrop for the bed area. This room has the same facing as the living room with full height window. So the whole room is very bright throughout the day. And over here, you can see that cove lighting has been done. So this adds ambience to the whole room. The recessed light has been strategically placed on both sides so that there's no direct light shining on you when you're lying on the bed. The owner has also done a smart switch over here so you can control the lights directly from your phone. On the other side of the room is actually the study plus wardrobe area. Over here, you are getting a two-door wardrobe on both sides that's right outside the bathroom. Effectively, you are having a four-door wardrobe at the length of two, so saving you the extra square feet. The owner has also customized a huge three-door wardrobe with tinted transparent glass, complete with ambience light and a reflective surface, giving it a very pristine finish. So the highlight of this wardrobe is actually the middle section over here where you have a dresser area. So at the side here, you have shelves and at the bottom, you have drawers and cabinets. So very functional for you to keep your makeup and accessories. There's also a big mirror over here with a spotlight and also switch here for your hairdryer. The left and right side of the wardrobe has the same design inside with two columns for you to hang your clothes and also a three-tier drawer over here. The wardrobe is built all the way to the top so you have additional storage on top for your big items like luggages or items that you seldom use. Over at the other side is actually the study come work area. Currently, it has a very long desk with drawers at the bottom. So this design is the same as the bench at the dining area, giving you a lot of leg space. And this is a very conducive environment for two persons to work together. At the top over here, you can see cupboards has been done to give you additional storage space for your documents and books. The cupboard and the drawer has the same monochrome design giving it a very classy and uniform look. This room is bright and breezy throughout the day as it comes with a full height L-shaped window. You also get an unblocked view over here overlooking the canopy. The master bathroom has a similar design as the common bathroom. Check it out. So we have come to the end of today's home tour. And if you like what you see, do contact us for viewing arrangements and we hope to see you soon. Follow and like our Facebook, Instagram and TikTok and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more. And we are Home Gen, bringing you dream homes for, for many, many generations, generations to come. come.